Hello and welcome. How are you doing, my friend? Today I like to show you that how to notice that my car's timing belt is in a little bit wrong position. And I have in here this great car. What is this Honda Honda Civic car? And there is now situation that this car there has been installed new timing belt, but there is there has been happened situation that this timing belt is in little bit wrong position. About one this feel in or a couple of millimeters in wrong position in this timing feel area. And and how how I can notice that th there is now issue. We can notice that issue that when I drive that my car, I can notice that now this engine is different. There is idle speed is almost same, but when this become warm and hot, this idle, be, this idle speed is very low, something like 300 or 400 turns per minute. And then especially when I start to drive in my car, there is situation that when I insert this gear one in that way, and then when I start to drive this car normally, this Honda start to move very easily, but now there is like dead point that this car, car's force and the power is away, especially in these turns 1000 to 3000. This is really weak in engine. And, and then when I start to drive that my car, this, this, this car can suddenly stops because there is not so much power. And, and, th and then, then this car don't take acceleration. And it don't take speed and just now, like I am driving in this road, and then when I try to accelerate, this car hesitates, and, and now only in this 3000 turns, this car start to run. And, and I, I do that again, that when I drive in here normally, and then when I insert this gear one, and then when I start to accelerate, this car now is full throttle. This car don't take speed, and only that now. And then when I have bigger gear, like that way, and then when I try to accelerate more, it is this car hesitates so long when we have 3000. And in that point, I can see that now there is issue in my engine. Okay, and that was this information that how we can notice that we have timing belt in wrong position. Okay, now now I rotate in here and I I do that my test again. And there is this my I start to accelerate and and this power comes only when I have 3000 turns. And now there is like 2000 turns and then when I try to accelerate full kick down, engine is really weak. And then when 3000 comes, engine start to work. Okay, and that was this information. And next I need to adjust this timing belt to right position. Okay, and thank you for watching and have a nice day to you. Okay, okay, and now we are checking those crankshaft puller marks. And they are actually quite difficult to find in this Honda Civic, but I will show those. And there, there are two markings. And first one is in this field. And it's quite easy to locate when we look that that this pullers, this locking pin, what is the small part in here, when we check that area, 
because it is very near of that point and it is that small hole in here in that area. I take my pencil in this small cut in here. This is this feel puller and next I have in here this touch up pencil base coat. This is Carl car color and I will do in there small white marking that we can see this place better and it is just that small in here this thing and then I take this little bit extra paint away and now we can maybe see this white better it is it's just this one okay maybe maybe we can see it now better it is in here that point okay there there we have there is this marking okay and then then we and I it is quite now, now we can maybe see it then I take even a little bit more light that we can see but this is really bad that Honda has made this marking so poorly. This is because this marking is, is so bad. And then we need to look this naked second markings. What is small arrow in here? And now I have already made in here a little bit cleaning. And, and there is small arrow in there. And I will also use my white color. And I will do in here this line. And this is now this marking point and there we can see that there is this white arrow and then that point they must be insane this is the thing that one okay now they looks fine and now when I have I managed to insert those two things together because now they are a little bit in wrong position and I need to little bit rotate that my crankshaft and it happens easily so that I take my this crankshaft puller feel what is in here and then when I insert this metallic pin in here that small part in here like in locking position in that way and then when I do so that a little bit now I check that this white white area is little bit like in upper one and in here we can see that I need to little bit rotate that in upper one and they, then those white markings they are in shape okay let's do that and I take my feel and I insert that in here and, and then if we have cars spark plug away it is more easier but I think that I can little bit, it is actually moves quite easily and then I check those my white markings that how they are doing and it looks that I need to little bit rotate those more that then they are in insane because now this white marking is, is in here and this engine block markings in there and a little bit more movement okay and now I check and still a little bit more movement okay okay now they are almost even a little bit more okay and now they looks like now they are in position and let's look more now this, those two white markings they are in same and look that this this uh, locking pins place is in in that way it is not yet central but almost but look, look it is not in central and this is interesting okay now this crankshaft puller feel area this area is okay and then we can go to 
set up next place what is this camshaft area okay and let's go to look that next okay and this is then our next target to set up and here we have couple of information first we need to look that feel this camshaft camshaft this uh, feel and there is symbol in here like up and this up means that that this area must be in this TDC uh, this uh, setup in this up and then there is two lines one in here and one in here what must be in just same line like in that one and then when we look in this other side we can see also in there those lines and let's go to look also those lines because they are really really small and difficult to see and I take a little bit better view